I'm very good, thank you. Um, so nice to be here. What an amazing country, amazing place. I'm having a good time. Um, if I have a day off, and if I'm in London, so I will generally wake up quite early because my dog will come in my room and give me the old nudge. So that would be around 7.30. And then we go for a walk, a nice hour's walk in one of the, um, one of the amazing parks in London because we're so lucky there. Um, have some breakfast, um, go to the gym, um, and that takes me to about one, one, two o'clock. I'll probably go and see my mum and dad and my family. Um, maybe if one of my friends might be off work, so I have a coffee or a little bit of shopping. Super chilled. There's normally sport on in the evening, so the evening will be some sort of football that I'd like to watch. So that's about it, I'm really chilled. I mean, I still have jobs, some jobs where, you know, they are, I'm lucky like jobs like these were amazing, you get to travel, go to beautiful places, beautiful hotels and you're, and you're looked after and treated, you know, so nicely. And then you have some other jobs where, you, you, know, you, you know, fair enough, you're in the studio and you're shooting some clothes that you don't really care for and um, you could be there, you know, all day doing outfit after outfit, where that's a little bit of, um, you know, it's a little bit of a grind and, and not as enjoyable as this, but, um, um, it makes it worth it when you get to come and do these things. So um, yeah, it's, it's, still, it's still a great industry to be in if you're working. If, if you're in it and you're not working so much, it can be a really difficult industry. But I've been lucky so far, so. My sort of fashion is really sort of classic. I'm nice and sort of plain classic. I need a pair of white trainers because my feet from football are really <laughs> sore. So uh, a pair of white trainers always, um, a white t-shirt, I'm not really a lover of jeans. I've always got some sort of casual trousers on that are, you know, fit nice but feel a little bit casual and loose and comfortable. So white t-shirt, white trainers, comfortable pair of trousers, yeah. I <laughs> it probably don't sound too good, but I, I, like to, I like a little gamble. I like to gamble on sports. So that keeps me entertained most days. I don't encourage betting, but I'm quite I'm quite good at it, so that's the only reason I do it. I wouldn't do it if I was losing money all the time. <laughs> Ideally, I would have a house or a flat or an apartment, whatever, in um, in Hampstead, in London, in England, in London, which is it's an amazing place. It's really chilled out. It's near the big parks. It's a really nice place in London, and then maybe have somewhere abroad, maybe not too far from London, maybe south of Spain or south of Portugal for maybe the dark months in, in London. Go out there. Robinson's pineapple juice, I love that. Gambling. <laughs> TV and sport, I love my TV and sport. Did I say family? Family, friends and girlfriends, that all stands into one, doesn't it? Right, one more. Music, music. Oh, I need music. Even though it drives me insane. I need music in my life. See, I can't say anything like skydiving because I'm scared of height. That really scares me. I do want to go to Australia, but I'm scared of flying. I'm in the wrong industry. I hate flying. I'm scared of flying. So yeah, I would like to go to Australia. I need to do that. Travel more is going to be one, right? So travel further, maybe. I want to swim with sharks, but I'm very, very scared of them. Oh God, there's always a song stuck in my head. I would literally would have been probably singing it now without even knowing it. I'm known to always have like a Christmas song stuck in my head in, in this now, you know what I mean? It could be anything. I was just singing what we had in the, in the taxi. Who sings it? You give me something, makes me scared of that. Who sings that? Uh, I mean, at the moment, I like Frank Ocean. Oh, I like going to the cinema. I love the cinema. And I do like a series. You know what? The series I like a lot of crime stuff. I'm not very good reader. My mind my, my wonders. I start reading and then the next thing I've read the same line 15 times and I'm like, oh God, no wonder. Um, but I like to listen to a lot of podcasts. I don't know, I've always been jealous of my brother. My brother's got this huge personality. I'd like to be him. <laughs> We could swap for a, for a couple of years. We were best friends all our life until we were like 20. And then obviously, you know, girlfriends and boyfriends, um, he, his wife and his kids, so. But um, he was, I was always a little bit jealous of him because he's always, you know, the one who had, he, he, the huge personality, the funny one, and so yeah. 
my brother. I mean, my mum and dad always tell me to be nice and polite to everyone, and I think that goes a long way. Just be nice and polite, work hard, and yeah, give out the niceness and you get it back. Hi, I'm John Halls, and you're watching Demand TV.